Hello everyone, welcome to another new video on the channel. In today's video reveal all the secret tricks for you to have 100% accuracy and stop missing shots at the enemy. In this video I will not use any type of legendary or mythic skin because these skins have aim assist and most are P2W. Any poor or rich person can use these tips. So grab a pen and paper and let's go to the tips. Watch until the end so you don't miss any tips and then you can practice. Come on! First tip. Have a central point in the middle of the screen. This central point will keep you focused on the center of the screen. When you see the enemy, I will teach you how to do it. You can choose between the run icon or the configuration icon. I will use the configuration icon because it is round. You must drag the icon to the center of the screen between the four lines. Increase the icon to center it better. It is important that you do it correctly so as not to be out of the center of the crosshairs. When centralizing it in the middle correctly, you decrease the icon to the maximum. Very good. The central point is very important. You always keep it in the middle of the screen to have better accuracy. Next tip use aim assist. When the enemy is in front of you, the dots will turn red and you will have better focus for shooting. Disable the aim button to rotate. By disabling this you will have a more fixed aim because the aim button will not swing. Attention. This option is only good for long shots. So practice if you want to sniper rush up close. Another detail when deactivating this option, you must move the crosshairs on the screen, not on the crosshairs icon. And it is great to have a fixed crosshair on the enemy. Next tip, keep your FOV between 90, the camera, and the default FOV at 50, so you have a wider field of view with the sniper. A little closer to your operator. You will have a wide field of view, but your sniper will be close to aim better. Next tip use realistic scope. When using realistic scope, the central icon of the scope will get bigger, so it serves to help the central point, in addition to having a better focus. Next tip use touch to aim, to use the hard scope better. Hard scope for those who do not know, and keep the scope always open to hit passing enemies. Use switch when opening ads to have more fixed aim time to do better quick scopings. Next tip about precision scope sensitivity, use higher camera sensitivity and lower trigger sensitivity. This will considerably improve your accuracy. About perks, I recommend that you use the steel lungs perk to fix the crosshairs when you open the scope. The next perk use hardness to prevent your aim from going up when the enemy shoots you. Next tip use custom reticles to have a better field of view. I'll show the best reticles next. Be careful if you don't have reticles and it's easy. Just do the missions to unlock see the best reticules now. The first reticle, my favorite, is pinpoint. This reticle has a circle in the center of the screen. The next reticle is drop angel. This reticle directs everything to the center with the green icon, so it's easy to hit the right place. The last one is gridline. This one also has a green circle next to it and a cross, and very good for long distances. Let's assemble an ideal gunsmith to be accurate. Meanwhile I'll mention some warnings, I've changed my settings again, and I'll make the next video about my new settings. Another thing, they are trying to copy my content, I do not care about that, as long as I make correct tips, all the tips I do here I use in ranked matches to test. This guy is Harus Gaming, but he is making tips on a television, an iPad Pro, Everything is better on the iPad Pro. This does not work for mobile players and things are not really correct. I play on a cell phone. I give tips for cell phones. I don't play on a television with advantages. This is the best gunsmith for best accuracy. Enable this option to keep the sniper small. Very well. This was another video of tips. Turn on notifications so you don't see any new videos. These tips are also good for other weapons, and for bar mode, you can use and test. Next there is a gameplay where I did the test. I tested it on normal weapons in addition to the sniper, and the result was positive. Watch until the end. Thank you all. Until the next video. Bye.